Zero. Welcome back, everyone. Welcome back, Sorshu. Welcome back, Jake Nation. Welcome back to another episode of Six Frame Over It. And I want to make sure on my end to definitely post this one. If I keep forgetting to do it, I want to make sure this one goes up. But welcome back. I know it's been a while since we did Six Frame Over It, or whatever this show is going to be called, whenever it happens. I guess Six Frame Over It. Over yeah, it's I, I think it's, we're just going to keep the name. Yeah. But, um... There is a lot of trailers and news we got. We got some Guilty Gear. We got some some new indie games. We got some new games on her. There's some sleeper games, but we're going to get right into it. I'm going to start this off with something that they don't actually know about. Neither one of these people know. I knew about, about this for about like a month, and I was supposed to do it on the last video. I forgot. So for those who don't remember, about I think a year and a half, two years ago, there was a fighting game that came out called Indie Pogo. And Pogo was like a Smash Brothers ish game with like Shovel Knight and Rivals the Ether characters and all these other characters that are working on the game. game. I played it. I remember and it was it was basically Smash Brothers. It had like all these different, but the crazy mechanic was you always was jumping. Which at first I was like, this is kind of dumb. Mm-hmm. But after you played it a while, I was like, okay, kind of grows on you. There's been DLC characters and stuff since then. I need to check that out myself more because I have the game. I just need to go back and play it. But. Um, earlier, it was about, I think, a month or two ago, they had a Kickstarter for this new game. And, and it, it, for for those who are wondering, it's already been funded. They, they bit, like, within, like, the first three days, the game was fully funded. <clears throat> and the people who make Smash Brothers Flash made this game. Wow. So, and for those who played Smash Brothers Flash, which is a PC, 2D, Smash Brothers Fan game. made. Yeah, really Famous well made. Game. They, that game is good. Yeah. And they've been doing updates literally every month on that game. But let me show you the new game. This game is called Frame Makers. Let's get into it. Oh, wow. They have a um, Slay the Spire character. The blind. Oh, character. yeah. Wow, it's very. It looks. It looks. The combos look like Project M combos. Mm. Yeah, they look like Project M, probably, yeah. Look, as has melee hit stun and everything. Just what you want to go. You always want the melee hit stun. Oh my god, they have that character. What? They have like almost every indie major indie character. Wow, they're just being mod friendly right away. <clears throat> Well, I guess they found out what with Rivals of Ether and what they did. They're like, we should yeah. do it, just basically. Yeah. Yeah. It, 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 it's it's looking pretty saucy, honestly. It's looking pretty saucy. The game looks sick. I'm excited for it. Um, what's really interesting is the whole assisting thing. Like, when I first saw it, like, oh, these are all the characters there you can play as. I'm like, wait a minute. And I think what they're doing, they're doing like, and this is the thing that kind of bothers me with certain games. But I understand for specific games that don't have a full, like a full, like, like say if, if a character didn't have a full move list, I understand making an assist character. That mm-hmm. makes sense. But when you pick characters, I play games. I'm like, you could have easily made a full, like, fight list for it. They don't do it. Mm-hmm. But the game looks good. I'm excited for it. Um, as far as release date, it's, I think it's sometime later this year. I think it's like in... Don't quote me on this. I think it's like April. What's it May, called? June. Frey Makers. Frey Makers. Frey. R. I mean, oh, no, F R A Y. Oh, Frey Makers. Okay. Yes. Wow. So, the next game on the list that's kind of big. Um, for those who those who played it, I, it's a. I, I'm pretty sure it's a Chinese based game. I always I always get it wrong. I always say Taiwan or whatever. But um, those who played Dungeon Fighters, which has been the beat 'em up for that that been out for the past what. 10 years? Dungeon Fighters is made by Koreans. Yo, I still got it wrong. Yeah. 
And <laughs> it's, 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 it's going to be made by the Japanese because Arc Systems is like Japanese. Gotcha. But um, Arc Systems and Dungeon Fire team came together to make this fighting game. It's it's a it's a pretty short trailer, but it shows off a lot. So I hope you're excited about it. I am excited. And if you never played Dungeon Fire, definitely check it out. It's probably by far the most free best free, and no, it is the best free to play beat 'em up I've ever, ever played. It's yeah. animes, I don't know, it's over the top. And it's not really pay to win either, so that's good too. But Yeah. Uh the early game's easy though, but once you get late game it gets hard if you want. Oh yeah. But I remember Go, the veteran over here was telling me that back in the day it was Dark Souls rules in there. <laughs> oh yeah, it was no, it was hard, man. Like getting to level forty what took like a like a couple weeks. Like it was, I'm I'm telling you, it wasn't like they made it way easy. I don't know. I, I mean, I guess, but right. yeah. But um, but let's get into the trailer though. Let's let's get to this. Neopal, that's the name of the company. I couldn't think of the name of the other company. Yeah, it's a Korean company. That's the stuff. I mean, that's, that's the. the I know that we still, all know that's, that's the, the grappler. Yeah, grappler. the striker. Gra oh yeah. Mm. And I'm guessing that's a super. That, that's the you know the character with the axe you call the racist. That's basically the. Character. That's our. I, I figured as much. With the fire, yeah. But I want to rewind here a bit because this trailer. Oh, I think there's more. Is that it. That's it. Right now, the game is, I think, is still in development. But there's there's a lot of stuff to see here. It looks good. Like, fighters and stuff, though. The animation's crisp, you know? Yeah. That's obviously the swordsman. But that looks like the berserker. Yeah, but it's the berserker. Really I'm yep. pretty sure it's the berserker. Here's I played the, a ton of berserker, but yeah, you can play uh, the girl, a Zimbabwe. female fighter. And for those who don't know, uh, when it comes to this game, um, it's not like, oh, you picked... It's not like a... It's not like Smash, when you have, like... Peach and Daisy, they're like echoes, but they do the same moves, or maybe slightly different. No. When you pick a version of the female version and the male version, they're basically completely different characters. As a yeah, whole. male, female, are not skins. They're different characters. Like yeah, male so it's kind of cool. So the different. gender specific is actually based on skill and all this stuff, so it's kind of cool. And that's obviously the grapple, the way he grabbed them. Yeah. That's obviously the grapple. Now the, now, the question is, like we said before, is it going to be variations? Because each character, like the fighter, the Swordsmaster and all these different people have six different classes within their class, subclasses. So it'd be on average, it's four on it average, at, but yeah, some have yeah, five. Yeah. But it'd be interesting if they either merge it into one, like they take bits and pieces for all, or if they make if they were smart, they would go to MK route, yeah, and do different things. And if they want to go above and beyond, they can do like you can customize your very yo. Could you imagine? My like, God. The customization. If if I don't think they'll do this, I think no. they'll be pushing it. But if they did decide to do that, man, and that's actually that's a gunslinger. That's a gunslinger. Yeah. Honestly, I like this look better than what it looks in the game. The ba the base, the base way it looks, and I'm not saying because the graphics, just the way his outfit looks. Like this outfit, like when I, I'm not gonna lie, when I see the male gunner in the game, I'm kind of like meh about it. No, but you can get that outfit the... in the game in Dungeon Fighter. You can you can buy the outfit and look like that. Oh, this one specifically. Yeah, okay. Yeah, you can. Mm -hmm. Well, it's that's out of rotation though. It's out of rotation. It's... Well, we go back. That's the striker. That's actually striker. Yeah. Yeah, the way she did the shoulder check. That's that's striker right there. That is. Was that the lancer? Go back. Go back again. It happens it, like this trailer. Oh no, that's the character I play with the with the. Okay, that's the girl. That's the yeah, and and it cut straight to the super, and then of course I recognize part of this. This has this is part of your um your awakening move, so that's kind of cool. But it was weird. I think you know what I think they're gonna do um to to light her weapon on fire. It's probably gonna be like a like a super or something to light her weapon on fire or something. Oh yeah, and then she gets like buff buff, or you yeah. get damage over time or something yeah. crazy. <laughs> so that game was looking cool. Arc system is on a roll with a lot of these games and everything. Um, one another thing. Spe speaking of uh. Them and a bunch of other games, or whatever. Um, one there's been two other games we've been kind of we've been kind of behind about. So, um, the game I'm about to talk about now, Grand Blue Fantasy. Grand Blue Fantasy dropped um a DLC trailer, and there's actually a, um at the end of the trailer, there's a little bit of a surprise character. I wouldn't say surprise character, but it's another reveal for the next character. Also, if I remember at the end of this trailer, but this character is um UL, 
I, I still don't know much about the Grand Blue Fantasy universe, but I do need to see like the anime and stuff to find out like yo, because a lot of you, like seeing the gameplay and I'm like I don't know anything about these characters. I need to do and and obviously I need to play the arcade mode to find it. Also, I haven't been doing anything. I, I either play that. just practice mode whatever. Isn't there an MMO based on it? Yeah, Rainbow that's the thing. Oh, okay. In the MMO game, it's like Monster Hunter. That's the crazy thing about it. It's there. It's like an anime Monster Hunter game. I'm just like, it looks sick. But hey. Yeah, no. Let's get into this trailer. Though. Psy games, Arc Systems. Arc Systems is just destroying it. They're literally rubbing dirt in the wound of Capcom. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> A real tickling. I just realized she said that. Oh, this is like a great character. Dances around the opponent. This must be a great character. She's probably ultra safe. <laughs> yeah, look at that step back. Look at you. Oh, what, what? oh, wait. No. You see that? The step back? Oh, my goodness. That's going to be annoying. <laughs> <clears throat> oh. Ooh. She's kind of nuts. That's her EX, obviously. What was that? It's Yoko the Fox. I'm just kidding. Oh, they didn't show the full move. That sucks. Aww. It teased us. I wanted to see what the full anime move. And I think at the, I'm pretty sure at the end of this trailer is the other character, which everyone is a lot is very is very pissed off about for the most part. Okay, but um, that character's pretty cool for the most part. It, it, I mean, I'm I'm digging it. Um, it didn't show the other character, but the other character is like, and everyone's been having this huge gripe about. I don't know his name. That's probably why I can't find who the character is. But a lot of people been mad because um, because um, I guess people who are fans of the show, they're like, of all people you could pick, that's who you pick. And the character is another one of those really, really short characters. But he's short, and he like. Floats, and I was just like, hmm. "Okay, I like it, it, it's like it's a it's a really weird thing." I'm just like, I like I don't know how he plays. I don't know how he's relation to the show. I'm assuming he's not like one of the, the fan favorites because most characters in the game been, I guess, fan favorites based on what I've been seeing. So it's like, so I don't know. Uno, that's his name. His name is Uno. Uno. I, I was trying to figure out. Oh no, 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 not Uno. Uno. <laughs> Uno. Oh, U N O, okay. Yeah, yeah. Like Uno, like I'm um, Uno out, basically. But let me see if I can find him at the end of this trailer real quick. He is right. And he looks weird. Just to let you know, he looks all types of weird. So here we go. Found it. Oops, sorry. <laughs> this is wrong button. <clears throat> Now I don't know what the emblems, the emblems record represent though. That's him right there. See that little floating guy? Mm -hmm. Whoa, that's a weird. It's a weird character. Like he's tall yeah. as the other characters. I mean, he's float. I don't know. He's weird. He looks like a kid with a giant beard. Right. So, so it's like they put a giant beard on a kid. That's what it looks like. Yeah, and a lot of people, as far as I know, wasn't liking it. I was like, I was yeah. like, this is a really weird character. Could you imagine? He can never get hit by lows. Could you imagine if that's one of his gimmicks? Nah, that's too busted. I don't like. You, oh, you, think, his, you think his cape is a hitbox? You think his cape is a hitbox? They'll make it a hitbox, even though it won't make any sense. They'll make it a hitbox because that that would be too cheap. M imagine you have to hit mids all the time. The only time you can hit him with a low is if he's crouching. That's like that's that'll make him top tier right away. Think about it. Because well, that, that is true. Unless he, when he blocks, he touches the ground. So if you want to like 
evade lows, don't block. Like, you know, make a weird dynamic like that. You know what I mean? That's I true. Know. That's true. I don't know. But, I mean, I'm pretty sure Grand Blue, as far, far as I've seen it, me play it's a very balanced game. So I'm pretty sure they'll yeah. find a way to make it work for the most but, part. But you're right. I'm not feeling his design. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. I, I can see why a lot of people are pissed. Now, <sighs> the ride the Arc System wagon still. Mm-hmm. Um, this um, this trailer dropped on actually the, the new year and kind of snuck on the radar at least for me until like later on. Mm-hmm. Um, this is a for Guilty Gear Strive, so you know how hype I. Even though I'm not good about good on the game, but you know how hype I am about this game. But I'll just play the trailer. Goat already knows what the trailer is. I know Goat's seen this, mm-hmm. but uh, I know Surge hasn't seen this, so I think he would know who this character is more or less. So let's go. He's back, guys. He's back. <laughs> the feminine dude. What a... <laughs> yeah, you know you have yeah, the impression though. Yes, yeah, it's just, yeah, it's just right. Yeah. <laughs> He's safe on everything. I used to play him. I used to play him too. He's safe on everything. He can make everything safe. So. And that's what I'm afraid of. All those hitboxes he has, like. Uh... What? what? See that butterfly was so cheap. Remember when the. If you EX it, the butterfly gets bigger and it drops on you, so you can't do anything. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Because the butterfly used to hit you, then the butterfly will pop up and it'll get bigger and get on you, so you can't so, block. So let you know, yeah. and this is kind of this kind of um, is it interesting to me. So we now know officially that there's only 15 characters in the game when you first start off the game. Which to me, I'm just like, why That's can't people? Eh, I, I, I don't know. I feel like 20 should be the number, but I don't know. That's just me. I mean, I'm probably going to still, I'm going to still get this game regardless, even as much as I complain about the number. I mean, nothing can ever be worse than Street Fighter Five when they did the number. Uh-huh. Yeah. I think I think the first one, I think XR X Zerg had, I think fifteen from the start, right? Yeah, it did. I think third, and then they went to third two, and then Revel, Revel, yeah. Revelator into whatever you know. But um. Now the question is, who's the final character? That's the question. Dane, you have any ideas who the final character might be? Okay, we don't, let's uh, see who's the missing. only person I haven't seen yet is the girl with the guitar. But I was telling Goat, there has been times she hasn't been in the game. That's, That's the only true. person I can think that is. But she's like one of the staples, though. Not having her. But in she hasn't record. been in every single game, though. That's, That's the true. thing. She hasn't. I can think of like one or two, like one game or two, just she hasn't been in. And then she's been and in the one game. She was just a, as a boss. She wasn't even a playable. Yeah, I know. Yeah, her name's I know. I know. Yeah, so. Who's uh, there? Jack? Jack? Who, who is Jack? I'm sorry, I need you're familiar. Who is Jack? The guy with the sword that May is lusting over all the time? Yeah. yeah. Is that the one who put the dust all over the place? No, he, well, he he's the, the swordsman. Um, with the black, and he has the like the cowboy hat. Oh yeah, that's the one. I'm yeah, talking about. he 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 used to do the, he did the coin flip thing, right? Yeah, yeah, he the coin. Yeah, I know who you're talking. About. I know he's you're talking really about. good. He's just he's hard to use in every game. Hey, go. He's he's not a scrub character at what all. What if yeah? the final character is the guy with the big sword you love so much? What oh he, no, he, free I'm neutral, just... free neutral man. <laughs> like I can't, oh, I can't think of the guy's name right now at the top of my but I play him. In like he's man. he's an and old actually, man, but it, when he goes, he. he yeah, when in his youth he yeah. gets big and he's a giant, giant butcher knife sword. Yeah. Like. Yeah. No, it's a joke. No, I know he's probably not going to be in there. Yeah. But it's it's, lit- it's literally just a joke or whatever. It's a yeah. joke. Because Go hates him when I play him. He's like, like, it's like, I can't press a button. I'm like, oh, <laughs> I can't do nothing. But, um... On another note, though, but we're going to end this on the best story. I had to save this for last. Mm-hmm. So, for those who don't know, and there's a little bit of a story behind this. So, I'm pretty sure y'all hype about SNK, and y'all know where I'm going with this. Mm-hmm. So, 
Um, last last year they hyped up in January there was gonna be a King of Fighters trailer. It was supposed to drop initially January the sixth, if I'm correct. And and um showing off the game. And they hyped it up that day. Like literally SK was like, yo, I hope y'all hype for the game. Everyone was like, Yeah, King of Fighters, they're gonna flip a table and then and all of a sudden, it was just like, like I, it was like either 20 minutes to an hour before. After they said, are y'all hype about it? They were like, oh, yeah, by the way, we're not showing the trailer today. Everyone got pissed. You're right. Like, pissed. And then all of a sudden, like, when it was on the 8th. So about literally yesterday, like, it was, and I remember when I saw it, because it dropped, like, I was up playing, I was actually playing DFO. And it was like, it dropped, like, 3 o'clock in the morning. And I was like... Yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, you have to understand they they relieved they released it in their time. So I, I know, I know. I'm yeah. not I'm not worried about the time period. Yeah. It's the fact you just did that. Like the only I mean, you should just say it's canceled or something. Don't like mm-hmm. like honestly, if you knew, and this, and I don't think I don't, I think it was a miscommunication between the teams. I think that's what really mm-hmm. happened. I think they American, were like, yo, yeah. we still got it going. We got it going. And then the guy was like, uh, um, sir, we're not ready. He's like, yeah, we're going. We're coming out with it. Wait, what? We're not what? <laughs> He's like, whoa, 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 buddy! I, I we got, we yeah, got. We're, we're not what? <laughs> you want your job? <laughs> Look, you, quit your job. <laughs> <laughs> you know how big of an upset this is gonna be? Everyone. Yeah. And then the funny thing is when they posted on on Twitter, explain like the scenario. They're like, I hope you, I hope you greatly appreciate appreciate it. We're, we're we're sorry. And everyone was like, man, I'm that mess. I was like, right. <laughs> the way they wrote it. I was like, I, I was like, I hope you can understand. And I was like, yeah. And then, and of course, Devin she's on the mail. I was like, you understand? So it's a tough time with COVID, and everyone's like, man, no, that's no excuse. I want my truly not. You know, how people. Some people just don't care. Just <laughs> they want to get with the entitled nonsense. But let's get into the trailer. And the trailer, I got the long trailer. Just so you know, mm-hmm. this this includes a bunch of other stuff. So there's some surprises in here. People who already seen the trailer knows what I'm talking about. If you have it, let's enjoy. Let's get right into this. It looks so good. Uh, if you compare to what happened before, 14, yeah, I guess, yeah. yeah. It looks better than Street Fighter Five. That yeah. game, that game. <laughs> yeah, it. It looks like they, they. There's a lot that needs to be finished before they. You know. The King of Fighters, 15! Set all expectations. Coming 2021. Hi, Yo, 15. Soon, it's a great day. It's a great day. I know they're sweating bullets right now. After what happened on the 6th, they're sweating. Look, look at the guy on the left. The guy on the left, like, man, I almost lost my job the other day. <laughs> but you know what? I want that shirt though. Shatter all expectations. This is a simple <laughs> shirt, but I kind of want it. Yes, take your time. Get the delayed game for it to be good. Sure. え、これからカプヨーズのブラッシュアップとプラットフォーム向けの最適化のフェーズに入っていきます。まあ、まだまだ問題が出るとは思いますが、え、ちょっと準備中です。え、今後の予定はどういった感じでしょう。はい、え、
、えー、テーマソングに合わせて慶応力キャラクターが活躍する素晴らしいものになると思いますのでぜひご期待ください That's cool. アニメーションはい、えー、皆様のご期待に添えるような、えー、I wonder if the anime is going to be like remember that one anime I told you about the King of Fire anime that came out like two years ago Years like ago, I know the one about、like、that. that came out. Or is it going to be like an、ago. anime anime? Like it's going to be like 2D or whatever? Oh, this part. This announcement is pretty cool. No, it's like, a, it's like a different version, apparently. Really? We have one with some of the DLC, but I don't think we have one with like all the DLC. It doesn't matter, like with all the costumes, I think.、Oh. But, but, no, but keep watching, there's a reason for it. There's a reason for it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Please surprise him to say there's、uh, crossplay. Not too much. Yo, that would be sick. Man, Vanessa's really good in this. I know, I know, Serge is like smirking over there. I know I'm gonna have to look at this guy. I know he's like,、smirking. oh, wait, wait. I love Harder, and he's he, he's like, um, um, what's her face, but weirder. And that's the, and that's the, uh, that's the contest, or whatever, yeah, yeah. See, it's gonna include, I don't think the costumes were included in the original one, I don't think it was. That's a nightmare geese costume. Yo, where's that costume? I don't remember that costume. I don't remember that. Oh, look, the Carrie p a r m i p a r m i outfit. I love that kid. <laughs> oh, come on. He has four themes. That's kind of cool. I think there's going to be at least 70 characters in the next one. Like, oh, we have a hidden outfit when we get to the end. Like, I'll, I'll get into that、right. in a second. They're like, we had there was a, a final outfit for Mai, she had nothing on, but we couldn't release it for some reason. Well, sorry, folks. <laughs> Wait a minute, did you catch that? Well,、mm -mm. this is a small little detail. Look at this right here. Notice something? What? So soon? We're not, we're not getting a physical release. I mean, I don't really care, but、um, that's just crazy, though. Yeah.、Only、Can we upgrade our, our existing one, though? I'm, I'm pretty sure it's going to be an upgrade. I, I'm pretty sure. Because Street Fighter V did it. Street Fighter V did it. I, I, I think、edition. they're going to do it. And it is getting I, I just、everything. noticed that. I was like, wait,、mm -hmm. we're not getting a. And me and Brandon are like physical copy and. And, and、um, Surge, too, are like physical copy fans. Now, this should be the announcement I was hyper. I was thinking this one. Yeah, this one. This one's kind of sick. Yeah, I was kind of happy about this. This is going to be hype. Hold on. I think this is a good move in there. Was he not originally Ultimax? Did they make it sound like he wasn't a. Oh, that's what it is. That's why they're hyping him. He looks like a boss character from that game. Remember? No, Nameless was like one of the characters people love, but he never showed up in the game again. Oh, okay. He only showed up in like one game. Talking about strict timing.、Oh, there you go, Coach. This is strict、yep, timing. That's... Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> With the battle cry. This is the part I was kind of hyped about. And they got rollback net code. They did. They're doing the right thing here. It's open source. We didn't have to pay for it. Yeah. <laughs> Oh look, my character. Oh, that's hard. That's that's really hard to do. I don't do that. You just cancel it at the end. Like you can't mash it, or it won't come out. You need to do it like at the very. End. <laughs> oh wait, wait. I'm I'm waiting for the put and PC right. Uh -huh. Okay. I'm waiting. Wait, Ed. Oh, they didn't do it. <laughs> They're going. Hey. Turn my phone now. Darn phone. <laughs> oh, turn it off. DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。DLC。
So next week we gotta find out what's going down. The next week should be hype. But um, I was I was pretty hype about all that. Um, the best thing to come out of that was the King of Fire's 15 trailer. I know it was short, so I guarantee people were a little bit pissed off about it being short. But it is what it is. But we get another trailer next week, so as long as they put it on point on time, like and they learn from their last mistake, I think we'll be fine. I think they'll mm-hmm. they're on their end will be fine. Um. I'm really hyped about King of Fire 2002 on PS4. That's actually coming. Cool. I mean, I have it on Steam also, but if I can have it on console again, that's 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 perfect for me. Yeah, you can play um, your friend. Yeah. Now, as far as like we were talking about earlier, but I mentioned it earlier, I'll talk about it after the the character roster. I think they're gonna go all out with this character roster. I wouldn't say all out, all out. I think almost. I think they're gonna try and make this on a level of. And actually, it's funny. Me and Brandon were talking about this literally yesterday. It's we were just talking about because Brandon, Brandon, like I told you, Brandon jumped on Steam later, whatever, and all this stuff. And and I was like, yo, I, I got man, did you see the King of Fire 15 trailer? Like King of Fire 15. I was like, yeah, you didn't see it. He's like, no. And he looked it up. He's like, he got hyped or whatever. But one of the things we were talking about how King of Fire 13 was such a great game, and we were talking about like how sales do. Like over there, it does, of course over overseas it does amazing, but here it doesn't do good. And I was like. I was like, I, I told him I was like, here's I think this is I think this is the reason why 13 and it did good but didn't do good at the same time. Mm. I think it had to do and it had to do with a couple factors. One, the hyper evo stuff. That makes a difference. Yeah. And I think the other thing, and I didn't even think about this until later on. So does anybody remember King of Fires 12? I, I don't like to talk about it. Oh man. Wait, that existed? Wait, no way. Exactly. So for yeah. uh, with the joke, um with Goat's joke. People who don't know King of Fighters 12, if not, is probably the worst King of Fighters game to come out. To uh, be next, fair, far, it was a beta. One, to a lot 13. of people say Maximum Impact was one worst yeah. ones because that was the the first one to 3D. I mm-hmm. actually personally thought it was kind of cool for what it was, but hey, personal opinion. But um, it was the prototype to 13 though. Yeah, it literally fair. was a prototype. But one thing 12 yeah. did do right, and this is what you said. Mm-hmm. Um, the music actually wasn't bad. That was a good thing they did right, and then the sprites were amazing. But the mm-hmm. gameplay, you know, I remember playing the demo when it dropped, and I was hyped, and I was like, what is this? Yeah. I was like, okay, I was like, you know, it's just a demo. It, they're going to fix it. And then when my friend bought the game, I was like, who mans is this? Yeah. This is not that thing here. It I know. plays weird. It doesn't, the movement was janky. Yeah. The it, combos didn't come out. Oh, my goodness, man. So when 13 dropped, which was like literally, I think, not that long afterwards, it was literally a beta. It was it was a it was a right. early so people, access. Yeah. So people, I think, initially had like it's almost like think of it like remember with Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite. It's not on the same level, but you get what I'm saying. Like Marvel mm-hmm. vs. Capcom Infinite came out, and it had all this bad rep for it. But towards the end, it showed all these cool. Like I give you for example for me when Marvel Infinite came out, I was like, I was like, man, I'm actually not. This is probably the first Marvel vs. Capcom game I'm not going to get. And it wasn't until I saw those new uh, gameplay tutorial videos like. Wait, this actually looks kind of cool. I mean, the graphics are questionable, but it's really a cool game. And then I still think it's a really good game. Now, I know I know what the issue is, the X-Men characters and all that, so I, I totally understand. But at the end of the day, you got to understand when, when when certain people dips their hand that shouldn't be dipping in, it is what it is. But um, And I think this was sort of that same scenario where it was like, oh, 12 was bad, so we're not sure we're going to buy 13 now. Mm. And then, and then people, I mean, people know thirteen turned out good. Thirteen is probably one of the best ones they ever made, next to like two thousand two, which is and everything. And ninety eight, ninety nine games of that nature. For as far as King of Fires go, I'm not talking about Fatal Fury or the fighting and all that stuff, but just the Dream Fight series or whatever. But um, but I think, and I think they're trying to get their rep back because Fort. And then, and the thing is, they come out with these games, and I think what the other issue is with them coming out with games and trying to. The reason why they're not doing good, they're trying to. So think of it like this. So when the Apple iPad, um, Apple um, AirBuds came out, right? Everyone tried to do the same thing, right? Mm-hmm. Correct. Everyone tried to make their own, which could yep. be good or bad. That like, sounds pretty good. Like, I have, uh, I have my own version, you know. Mm. Right, right, right. Mm. So, it, but in certain cases, that when people try to copy all people, it becomes good or bad. Yeah. So, and in theory, when they made 13 to 14, and this is just a guess. This is just a guess based on what, what I've been seeing, what the pattern with them. 
So when they made 13, 13 got everything right. But the bad rap from 12 may not sell as much. Mm-hmm. And they noticed people was putting this easy mechanic stuff in the game. They're like, you know, we should probably do it to make the game a little bit easier. Right. And they're like, well, if such and such did it, why not we do it? Then they then they made it, they took it overboard. Right, and, and that everything. pissed people off. And they're like, wait, we did all these characters, we did this, we have more characters, all these games, what's going on? It's a great game. It's like, and, it, and, it, and, and I think this one, this time they're like, you know what? We need to keep what 13 have, but we have to take elements from this, and this will be the perfect game, basically. Mm-hmm. And I think that's what this is going to be. I'm hoping that's how they're thinking about it. Because I think, I think they were trying... And I'll give them credit for trying to try new things. I give them credit. Like, it wasn't to the point where it, like, pissed me off. It was like, oh, my God, this game is easy. It's, I mean, 14, to a certain degree, is still a hard game. No, no, 14, just the only thing easy about 14 is the, the square, 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 square combo. Besides yeah. that, everything else is, like... Yeah, it's, but no, it's, not strict, it's not strict. It's not strict to thirteen. So oh, if they 13, take, it's not strict thirteen. Yeah. So if they could take certain elements from fourteen and take take certain and take some of the elements from thirteen, mm-hmm. I think that I think fifteen is gonna be an amazing game. And then with the ending of fourteen, and I don't know if you knew this, go. I think me and Serge talked about this a while back. Was with um at the end after the main god ancient deity whoever died or whatever. <laughs> apparently, everyone got somehow resurrected through the power and you know anime. Whatever. <laughs> the reason why Geese came back and, and apparently Rugal came back. So I'm as, I'm assuming I'm assuming every boss that was in the King of Fires is probably gonna show up in this game. Yeah. I, this is a guess. And I think it's gonna be nuts. I think almost everyone's gonna I, mean, I don't think every single person gonna come back, but I think every fan favorite's gonna come back. That's my guess. I think I think we're gonna see Rugal in this game. No questions asked. Oh yeah, Rugal. I think um, Rugal's definitely gonna come back though. Hey, what, wait, what's that dude? Is that, is, wait, Yo. what's, who's that dude who's black, who has all black, but his sister's playing piano? What boss is that? Oh, okay, there you go, yeah. Yeah. I thought he was some of the other was black boss that worked Remember, in the I thought he was some of the other black I hated him more than Rugal. Like, Adele, he's, he's, he's cheap, man, because he has that mobility. Mm. Yeah. Genesis Cutter, I mean, what? Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Genesis Cutter. Uh, Sir, I know. I know you look like you wanted to say something about this. Are you no? Know, before before we wrap this up, no. You got you look. No. Any characters say? you're planning to play? Any characters you're planning to play? <laughs> He's not going to tell. Okay. I understand. But um. Hey man, you guys still need to do your first to ten running back. I remember that. We will not talk about the first to ten at the moment. But oh when my the time God, comes, man. I'll, I'll was winning so hard, and then like. Surge came back with a vengeance. <laughs> I remember it. I'll never he got on my head, man. He was messing with my head, man. <laughs> but um, but thank you for watching. This is another exciting episode of Six Frame Over Red. I hope you enjoyed all the trailers. A little bit of nuanced news, and we'll be back to you soon with more content. Um, and source you out. Source you out. Bruce. <laughs>